right. The gang's assembled and are in position to help you get up to that vault. For the rest of the operation, you are the ball. Roger, Bentley. I'm starting my approach. Getting over these fortress walls shouldn't be a problem. Look, we're running five by five here. Make sure everyone's in sync. I hear that. Artillery, sure you can make that shot? I endeavor not to miss. Excellent. Radio control. In position. Recovery team. Are pumped. Submersibles. Showtime, baby. Telekinetics. I don't know die. All right, it's the crime of the century and the ball's in motion. Wow. Tonse, Tonse, people. My name is Sin K. You can call me Sin for short. And welcome to Sly 3 Honor Among Thieves. What a way to start. There's some new characters that we don't know about yet. So I'm actually. Take up position for a Yank 86. Oh. Oh. Not a visual. Am I going the right way? I don't even know. Whoa. The game looks so much better. What the fuck? That's more clear, like smooth. I'm so confused. Is this the same sly? Huh. The ball has stopped rolling. We've got an obstruction. I'm on it. First is away. Second guy is pulled. Third skyward. Roll on, pal. Over. Oh boy. Agent Old Rock, prep for timber. Hiya, how are you? Ah, well done. Let her rip, Old Rock. Ball's in position. I don't even know what he said. Nice work. The ball's got a track. Over. Where's Murray? Where's my favorite character out of this whole goddamn franchise? This whole series, I mean. Ball requesting door via Agent Monarch. Over. Launching. Stand clear. Beautiful. Be advised, ball is nearing the lab. Agent Deep Six, you ready? Spear gun loaded. Can't wait to see what else they've added. Okay. Agent Deep Six, deploy! First is down. I'm reading both force fields down. Strong work, Deep Six. Every time. How's your wife doing, Richards? Oh, very well, Dr. M. Thank you for asking. Very thoughtful. Mm -hmm. Man, your son, uh, what's his uh -huh. name? Mike? Mark, sir. He, he's well, too, yeah? He's well, too, yeah? <laughs> it's a shame you won't be seeing them again. Ah, uh, sir? Afraid I poisoned your drink at lunch. Sorry, Richards, but I don't tolerate poor performance. You should have changed the security code from one, two, three after you installed the new system. I'll improve, I swear. No, you'll die any second round. Oh. 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 Yes, water leaking into the lab. I'm on my way down. Oh. And get a janitor for the lab elevator. Richards got sloppy. The Cooper vault is just across these wires. I'm en route to your position for the loot hall. Over. Okay, I'm looking around. I don't see any wires. Oh, never mind. I just didn't look down. Duh. I am very frightened. Oh, what the fuck? Power down the turret with that security code. It 
That's three, right? <laughs> One, two, three. So it's a key. What? Cooper! Oh, you must be Sly Cooper, the new keeper of the cane. Oh, how I long for this. This vault belongs to the Cooper family. You're trespassing. No, my naive boy, you're trespassing. I've got the deed to this island. This fortress is mine. Everything here is mine, which now includes the key to the vault and over the king. Sorry, pal. Family heirloom. Buy a knockoff at the gift shop. Oh, shit! Quick, let's regroup with the others. He's wheelchair bound? Oh yes, the last step is the last game. Come on, Minley. Come on. Oh my god. This place is flooding. We don't have much time. You said it, bro, you said it. Run, Benly, or I mean, roll. We are almost home free. Something's gonna happen. The boat's just up ahead. <sighs> no, Benly. No oh, this is bad. Oh shit. <laughs> it's not working! Save yourself! If he wants to eat, eat this! <sighs> His cane! Like they always say, your life really does flash before your eyes. Oh my god. There it all was, stretching back to my childhood. Born into a family of master thieves that went back for generations, I was next in line to continue the Cooper name. But fate had different plans. I was robbed of my childhood when a ruthless gang attacked our home. The orphanage I landed in wasn't all bad. It was there that I met my lifelong friends. Bentley, he's always been the thinker. And Murray, he's the doer. We'd stuck together over the years, and our skill, our confidence, and our thieving reputation grew stronger with each heist. We thought that the good times would never end, and that our luck would never run out. Which only made things tougher when the odds finally caught up with us. Then I met this guy, McSweeney, who claimed to have run with my father's crew back in their heyday. They pulled jobs all over the world and amassed quite a collection of priceless items. It was then that McSweeney told me all about the Cooper Vault. It seemed that my father, like all my ancestors, had been hiding their wealth in a secret place for generations, each one adding to the treasure hidden behind a door that if McSweeney's story is true, only a Cooper can open. Using some well-placed clues provided by McSweeney, we set out for the secret island that held the vault. On arriving, we discovered someone by the name of Dr. M had already set up shop. 
From the looks of it, he'd been trying to crack the thing for years, growing steadily more frustrated in his failures and more paranoid as the decades rolled by. He built himself a fortress with security as tight as Fort Knox. Getting inside the place would take precision, creativity, and moreover, it would take an army of world-class thieves. Finding and bringing together that much talent won't be easy, but to get inside the Cooper vault and collect my inheritance, I was willing to pay the price. If we're gonna make it to the Cooper vault, we'll need to perfect our thieving skills. I've rigged this place to push us to our limits. I'm guessing these levers start the different trainers. That's right. Each will initiate a streamlined crash course in grand larceny. I'll head for the control room, and we'll get things started. Dish it out. I'm ready. All right. Okay. All great thieves have one thing in common. Oh, the tutorial. Okay. Cash? No, they never get lost. Use the right analog stick to look around the hazard room. Try to find the Cooper gang marker I'm projecting. Great. Now press down on the L3 button to ping a waypoint. That's handy. I agree. These holographic markers are an invaluable tool for finding your way around in the field. Notice how the logo moves to the destination? Try clicking the L3 button a few more times to get the hang of it. Okay, head for the waypoint and we'll commence phase two. I programmed in a new mission destination. Press L3 to find it. The cool thing here is that if you don't have light, perfect. Now everyone knows that a thief's best friend is a rooftop. Provided he doesn't break his neck getting up there. Not a problem for a man with your jumping skills. Hit the X button for a standard jump. Then hit the X button a second time while in the air for an extra high double jump. Okay, well, this is all pretty standard stuff. We all already right, know this. Like, what's next? As you know, it's very useful to survey guards from the rooftops. To do that, we'll have to be able to look down at them. Let me guess. Use the right analog stick? Yep. Try to find the marker I'm projecting down there. Excellent. Now look up at that pillar. I'm projecting another marker. Okay. I can't... That's as high as I can go, dude. Uh-oh. Bro, it's not... Great. Okay, there we go. <laughs> now put all these skills to use and get to the remaining waypoints. Should be easy if you ping them with the L3 button and look around. All right. Oh, okay. Do I have to space them out? I have to space my jumps out, don't I? Bro, what? Oh, what the fuck? What's wrong with me? Nice one down. I'm so dumb. I'm here. I am trying to jump from one to the other building. Good job, Sly. You made it. You're now ready to take on the meanest of navigation tasks. Oh. Oh, no. You picked up a lot of skills after reading the previous Raccoonist. Heck of a page turner, that book. Let's see if you remember them all. <laughs> Check out those small points on that wire. You can land on them light as a feather using your ninja spire jump. Easy. I just jump and hit the circle button. Exactly. Try getting over to the other platform. Not bad. Oh, it's more precise this time. Cool. Looking good, Sly. You know how I love the second story work. Sure, but how do you feel about tight spaces? 
Try getting through the small opening in that wall. Hit the circle button when you're close to crawl inside. To crawl inside. Joke's on you, friends. I crawl for a living. Nice job, Sly. You're a credit to the Cooper name. Nice. We're all done in here. Let's head outside and get this operation underway. Hell yeah, let's go. Big boy stuff. Getting inside a world-class vault would take a team of world-class thieves, a group of specialists, each member contributing their own particular talent. It was clear that we needed Murray back. Not only was I missing a lifelong friend, but his brute strength helped get us out of more than a few scrapes in the past. When Bentley was injured during the whole clockwork affair, Murray blamed himself, eventually leaving the team. We tried to console him, but going out on his own was something he needed to do. He said he wanted to find his spiritual center. We got word that Murray ended up in the Australian outback, where he studied a mystic art called the dream time from an aboriginal guru. From all accounts, things went pretty well, and his teacher even sent him on a walkabout to locations all over the globe to complete the training. Latest reports have cited Murray in beautiful Venice, Italy, but what he's doing there is a mystery. I just hope he steers clear of the local mob boss, Octavio. Growing up, this guy used to be a real celebrity in the neighborhood. Everyone loved to hear him sing opera and said he was destined to be the next great tenor. But just as his career started to take off, musical tastes changed. Suddenly, it was all about rock music, and no one wanted to listen to opera anymore. He held on to a few fans of crowds, these crowd. monsters that took him into the business. Heading onto this guy's turf was dangerous, but worth it for a chance to make things right with Murray. Sly Cooper and the gang in an opera of fear. Huh. Wow, it's so colorful. Venus, Italy. Yo, the music though. Let's do this. Given Murray's criminal past, it seems logical to start our search at the local police station. If he's not already in custody, the cops are sure to have leads on all the crooks in Venice. Did I say Venus? It's called Venice. Bro, this is a big freaking map. I'm supposed to go over there? Oh, what does this do? Oh! How many hits does he take? That's a lot of hits. God damn. Alright. That massive dome marks the Venetian police station. Cops around here really like to make an impression. I'm afraid it's a losing battle. Don Octavio runs the show in this neighborhood. It's his security forces patrolling the streets, not the cops. Noted. Huh. Looks like I found my way inside. Well, that dome is covered in glazed tile. There's no way to climb up there. Oh, come on, pal. There's always a way. There's always a way. Is there any collectibles in this game, like bottles, or... I don't know, I guess we'll find out together.
Nice climbing, partner. I've got the blueprints to the vent system in front of me. I should be able to guide you to the jail cell. Here we go. Hey, Murray? Is that you? Murray, that name's a stain on my pants, bro. What? <laughs> oh my god, Dimitri. Cooper, you got some fuzzy dice to come round here. Dimitri, long time no punch. See you're still in jail. And you still a cracker box. Let's get past the name calling and get to business. Looking for main man Murray, eh? Sorry, but I'd rather see you get busted big time! God! Polita! Wait! Think of something to keep him quiet. I could try... I could try flattery. Where's that generous nature you're so famous for? I always pegged you as the bigger man in these types of situations. I'm a big man. Big with the payback and the sex appeal. <laughs> Got that end? I control the beat on this track. You're just the dancer. Let's try cutting him a deal. Get their mitts on me. Who's gonna break you out of jail? You might get this cell door open, but the cops would throw down and bust me on the way out. And then I'll get the double sentence. <laughs> Grief! He's right, it'll be tough getting him out of here. I need a plan. Maybe I could disguise us both as police, then walk out, distract the cops so he can get away, take him up with me through it on the air vent. Look, I got in here through an air vent. We can both use it to escape. I can't fit in no vent. You spy my macho frame. I'm packing too much sexy muscle to fit in vent like you <laughs> stink dudes. Oh my God. How about I get the cops' attention, then run for it? Once they're all outside shooting at me, you can slip out no problem. No, that's a plan I can get behind. Dimitri is free, and Cooper is cooked. Key for sale is in head cut lady's office. Okay, great. This other lock won't be a problem. I should be able to crack it by hand. Get me out of here, and I'll find Murray. No sweat. Just keep on the down low and out of sight near them coppers, bro. They're a bad bunch of bunnies. Your attention, please. I thank you for your patience, but we're now ready for the oh. presentation. As we all know, the nails of Venice have been mysteriously filling with tar for the last oh, month. Oh my god. No one is sure of the cause, but the effects have been devastating on the local wildlife and tourist trade. Our sources believe That's Carmelita? that this Don Octavio is potentially responsible for the disaster. Oh no. Unfortunately, we've got no hard evidence linking him is to the Is this a different voice actor? Oh god. Nice work. Head back to Dimitri's cell and free him. If he's true to his word, we'll be talking to Murray in no time. Let's get back to business. Oh. Now, where was I? Oh my god, she sounds even better. Hold tight, boys. The power's on the fritz again. It'll calm down in a few minutes. Better make sure you're under a desk when the lights come back on. Okay. I can see, da. I can see. I can see, da. I can see. Oh, come on. Oh, they're turning on now. Jeez, I could have went. You walk better in the dark, Petrov. Really, you are an ugly, ugly man. Jeez. <laughs> oh, <laughs> <laughs> real blunt. You're an ugly, ugly man. <laughs> Can you really crack this coconut? Sure. Just takes a light touch. Cool. Let's see some shine, bro. I swear, you spring me, and I'll hook you up with that plump dog, Murray. Dig? This safe will be tough to crack, but I've seen you open harder locks. Slowly rotate the left analog stick until you feel a vibration. Stop, then go in the other direction, again feeling for the vibration. Then a reverse direction again, and stop when you get the third vibration. 
Once the green light goes on, let off the stick and you're in! No! Okay. Oh, no, I went too far. Shit. No. No. Oh, this is so hard. What? What the fuck am I doing wrong? Oh my god, I went too far. Okay, there we go. Holy shit, that took forever. <laughs> I'll do like I promised and distract the cops so you can make your escape. Solid. Don't worry, no mind. Straightway, I'll password for Murray to find you. Meet at Rialto Bridge. Big Italian landmark. Okay. Guess it's showtime. Oh shit, what are we gonna do? Hello, assorted meatheads. And lady. Anyone feel like some exercise? Cooper! Grab him, man! And I'm out. <laughs> Cooper? <laughs> oh boy. See how good her gun is now. You've got some serious nerve showing up in my squad room. I was concerned we were growing apart. Then let's spend some quality time together in my interrogation cell. So forward. What happened to the demure girl I used to know? She grew up and stopped taking grief from guys like you. Guys like me? Are you saying I've got some competition for your affections? You're the only man in my sights right now. Oh. You ain't shit, man. You still got shit aim, ho. Oh, I'm just kidding. Alright, isn't that fast? Unlike this last game. Oh, I could be wrong, though. Almost lost at that time, Cooper. Oh, God. Run, run. What the? Greetings, old. Inspector Fox! Man, you're in it again. Hope that manhole works both ways. That's right. Hide in the sewers like the rat you are. <laughs> Thanks for the quick escape. I owe you one. Again. Of course, searcher. We are all in need of peace. You're really whole hog on this Dreamtime stuff, huh? My mind is clear, like the woodland after a forest fire. Listen, Murray, we need you back on the team. That thing with Bentley, it wasn't your fault. He doesn't blame you for the wheelchair. Sorry, Sly. I walk a different path. My guru, in his wisdom, told me to lose myself and not return until the black water ran pure. So here I stay. You sure he didn't tell you to get lost and not come back until you cleaned out the water filter? Come on! I'm on a real spirit quest here! Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> tell me everything. I've missed you, pal. Well, it's a long and awesome story. You got any gum? I love stories, bro. Job complete. Murray refuses to join the gang until the commitment to his guru has been fulfilled. Whether we like it or not, we've got to deal with Venice's tar problems in order to, as Murray puts it, make the black water run pure. 
Thanks to Inspector Fox's fine detective work, we already know that Don Octavio is somehow connected. As non-law operatives, we'll be able to tackle this situation in a more head-on fashion. First, we break into Octavio's opera house. If he's hiding anything, we'll find it. We should also keep a close eye on the dog. Some photographic evidence of him connected to the tar might be enough to get the old mobster put away. Of course, meanwhile, I'll monitor local communication frequencies. With some luck, we might pick up some quality intel. All right. Well, that was very intense. Let's see if there's any upgrades. Of course, the alarm clock on the smoke bomb. Nice. Venice operation. Okay, I want to explore a bit. See if there's anything worth collecting. Unless they scale down the collecting and put in, uh, what should we call it? Put in more, uh, story. You know what I mean? A, st a more story filled game instead of a collectible thon. Oh shit. There's really no bottles, right? What the heck, man? That was, that was the whole fun part about looking around. Just looking for bottles. Oh, what the fuck? Honestly, I don't even know where I'm going. Whoa, there are so many missions. Alright, I just want to try something. Can I... Oh, I can. Can I hit him? Ah, yes. Feels good. Feels natural. I'm actually really disappointed that there's no bottles. <laughs> And maybe it's just later on. Oh, shit, run. Click the L3 button to find a job. It's time to get started. I know, I know. We're going to one. Gosh. All right. Let's start the first job. Heads up, Sly. I've intercepted a radio message from one of Octavio's men. The Don is moving towards your position. Great. You want me to take him? No. We need evidence that he's behind this city's tar epidemic. With some incriminating photos, we might be able to help the cops prosecute him and put an end to this nonsense. Never thought we'd be helping out the cops. Really? You always seem eager to aid Inspector Fox. Yeah, well, she's different. Your average law enforcer isn't that, I don't know, attractive? Hold up, here he comes. <laughs> That's despicable. Get a picture before he finishes. This is perfect. Use your binocular to take photos. Oh, there we go. Excellent. A few more of these and the cops will bury this guy. Follow him. He might be headed for some more polluting. That is just like terrible, dude. Oh, Oh, where is he going? Oh, shit. <laughs> I wasn't expecting him to say that. Honestly, beautiful, though. Just, oh, even if it is just like vocal warm up. Oh, shoot. He's at it again. Get a picture. I'm trying. That Aha. poor bird bath. I guess more of a bird death trap now. He's on the move again. Keep it up, Sly. This is some... I got a what? Shadow, huh? You stink. Back in my day, thieves knew how not to get a caught. God damn it. He's on the move again. Keep it up, Sly. This is some great work. Oh, don't look at me. <laughs> He's getting away. You follow me, you stupid bird. Oh, 
Oh good, I lost the bird. What the fuck is that? What? I barely moved. Like, that was some bullshit, not gonna lie. Imagine clogging a delightful water wheel with deadly, sticky tar. Monstrous. Oh my god. Can I get a good shot? Hell yeah, I can. We want to make sure all this horrible polluting is fully documented. I got a what? shadow, huh? You stink. Back in my day, thieves knew how not to get a caught. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> Keep on it. We want to make sure all this horrible polluting is fully documented. Or at least the game's a little bit more forgiving. Before it would start me all the way in the beginning. <laughs> I don't know why that cough just felt so personal to me. Alright, I can't I can't remember all the vocal warm-ups. Don't turn around. Oh shit. It seems to be working a switch, but there's no tar anywhere. Yet. Get a photo anyway. Have to go up there. What is this goddamn fucking oh, I can't get him from here shit. Oh, dude, I might get fucking Okay, jump up jump up right away sin doing something but what? It's the pipe No. As much as I hate to see what hate is crying, this fiend will do next. You should probably keep on his tail. Someday the people will know the truth due to your pictures. Run. Oh, I follow him still. Where am I going? Hey, Samir, get that engineer on the horn. Sly, see if you can latch on to the car Octavio is riding in. We should eavesdrop on his phone conversation. From the look on his face, it seems important. Yeah, how can I... No. I got a shot. Oh, uh, back in my day, thieves knew how not to get a caught. Shut up. Oh, there we go. Listen, Giovanni. This Ferris wheel was a good idea. She's a pump on the tar fast. And nobody, but nobody suspects a thing. But still, is it gonna be enough to get things ready for my opera recital? Well, uh, when the people come to see me sing, I wanna make a show. They keep a coming. Even if they don't feel like it. One way or the other, there be opera fans again. Hey, 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 hey. Okay, see you soon. 
That fiend! He's twisted a time-honored amusement park ride into a tool for wrongdoing! Break open the control panel with your cane. I'm on my way to do a little rewiring. Oh, Look shit. Look away if you must. You're about to witness <laughs> the dark side of electrical engineering. Kill a bunch of poor innocent fish, will he? That'll do it. Holy fuck, that thing is really spinning fast. Run! <laughs> oh, no. Oh, thank God, no. <laughs> well, at least it saved the fish. And one more mission, and then we play as Bentley, right? Yeah. Ho oh, ho ho, we are here. This opera house is Octavio's base of operations. Nice place. Sure to be a few coins laying around in there. What's the plan? If you could get me inside to one of Octavio's computers, I should be able to hack his firewall and get the dirt on his operation. Okay, have you got a point of entry? I'm guessing the front door's not the safest option. That wooden hatch appears to be an ideal way to slip in undetected. Head down there and we'll meet up in a few minutes. Hell yes. Bum bum. I just love the music. Octavio is known to rely on 3D technology to secure his property. In order to see the security measures, we'll need to utilize these depth optimizer goggles. Functional and fashionable. Nice touch, Bentley. That's right. You can play this game in 3D because back then 3D was still new. That makes sense. To open this door, we'll need to press the 3D security buttons at exactly the same time. Okay? On my three. One, two, three. What? Again. One, two, three. Nice. I like how you push the button on the T of three instead of, you know, the whole word. Looks like Octavio is fond of this 3D synchronized security system. Let's do it. One, two, three. On three. One, two, three. All right. Oh my God. Drat. My booster won't be enough to make it to that next door. I've made a number of improvements to my wheelchair, but none that can float me through this canal. Don't worry about it, pal. I'm sure I'll find a way across. And there seem to be plenty of boats hanging around to make a nice bridge for you. Okay, I'll wait for your signal. Oh, you just have to make a bridge for him. Okay. Parkour! 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 Fine, fine associates, Octavio here. I am pleased to report that the TAR suction levels are at all a time high. However, it saddens me to report that some of you haven't been keeping in time with the orchestra. You know what I mean. <gasps> oh, I like shit. The and Julius in the main vacuum room immediately. We are going to discuss your retirement package. And if any of you catch these boys, make a run for it. Well... Shoot him in the back. Oh, this is kind of nerve-wracking. There we go. Are you serious? Some goddamn... Oh, why is it so dangerous here? <laughs> These things aren't even connected to anything. Look! Lies! All I see are lies there. Why put the lasers only there? <laughs> oh my god, I'm questioning things I shouldn't. <laughs> what is wrong with me?
Alright, that wasn't so bad. It was a little nerve-wracking, but it wasn't totally terrible. Who the heck? That door ahead of you is reinforced. We'll need to bob our way through it. Thanks for the assist, Sly. Maybe I can return the favor with some well-placed explosives. Aw, oh, dude. He's doing some insane parkouring right now. Okay, stand back. Thanks, pal. Hey. Aw, oh, no. I've just got to time it nice. Hey, I made some great timing. What the fuck? Why is he, you know what? This oh, door is made of four inch thick bulletproof plexiglass. My bombs won't make a dent. See if you can find a way around it through that ventilation shaft. Holy fuck, this is a fucked up vent, dude. Well, nice of you two to stop by for a little fatherly advice. Julius made a run for it, then the the curtain fell. Now, this room's empty. Crawl a little farther. They've got to have a lock switch somewhere. Shit. Oh, dude, he whacked them, didn't he? You two stoolies are gonna be in my new eyes and ears. I can't let no one get near my demolition switch. Or sabotage it. Oh, it's from inside of the family that someone's uh, not content. Then you tell me straight out. I can't be taking no chances this close to a short time. Got it. Got it. Come on, bitch. Oh, you dare hit me back? Oh, fuck. Tip to spit on ye. Thanks, pal. Judging from the security, we must be getting close. It's live. All right, gotta just sneak my way past. Be patient. Patience is always key to life and things. Oh, oh fuck. We did it. Never mind. What is up there? There's something over here. Is that all it was? Just that box? Just the boxes? I'm confused. That's all? Okay, well, let's go. Oh, this feels like a trap. It looks like a trap. Yes, a Wurlitzer 700. I could splice into this easy. Just as long as you're enjoying yourself. That's the important thing. Aside from a few tense moments, that break-in seemed to go pretty well. It's not over yet. Hack the system and let's get out of here. Oh, it'll be a snap extracting the details on Octavio's operation from this old dinosaur. Oh, bro. Wh what? A delay switch? Sorry, Sly. Guess the dinosaur has teeth. I'll hack as fast as I can. Watch my back. There are sure to be guards on the way. 
I got this, homie. Oh, never mind. I didn't know he was going to come through that door. I feel kind of bad for these birds. Oh, bro. Halfway there. What? He told us. Come on. I've almost got it. Oh. So close. What? Oh Download my god. Download complete. Now we can find out exactly what Octavio is up to. Yay, job complete. Oh. All right. Now we continue as Bentley. All right, let's make the good old switcher Ruby. Let's do this. Oh shit. Does he still have his thing? Oh, he does. Oh, that means he could just... Oh, that's so cool. Oh, the boosters are a nice touch. Oh, here we go. Canal chase. Oh, we're gonna be in a boat! Hey, Sly, you better get over here. My sources tell me that Octavio has hired the Blue Viper Gondola Gang to take out Carmelita. The Blue Vipers? Those guys are nasty. We've got to get to them before they get to her. She's off on her daily patrol. The thugs can't be far behind. On my way. Just make sure to have one of those police boats hot-wired by the time I get there. Let's see. Just cross the blue wire with the red wire and shazam! Just in time. There go the Vipers. I'll shoot. You drive, Sly. This canal is packed with shipping. Make sure to jump and weave or we're sunk. Let's take these. Sorry, Sly. My gun overheated. Guess I should use short burst. Oh, fuck. This is ridiculous. Holy <laughs> shit, there's so much going on. Oh shit, it wasn't paying attention to the gun either. Almost there, come on. Oh my god. Fuck! Oh, I hit a bridge! I destroyed a bridge! <laughs> I was wondering how Bentley was gonna shoot. Two more, two more to go. He's almost dead. Come on. Oh, can you not be a jerk, please? Yo, come on. 
on. Nice shooting, Bentley. Last one, last one. Oh, come on. Yes! Way to go. That's the end of the Blue Vipers. Blue Vipers, my ass. Another uneventful patrol. This city's beautiful, but a bit quiet for my taste. I hope you realize that by saving Carmelita, we're only making our operation here more difficult. Maybe so, but what's the fun in stealing if there's nobody trying to catch you? Besides, she's helped us out in the past. That, and you've got a thing for her. <laughs> and I've got a thing for her. Look, I'll stash this boat. It might be useful for later. You stay out of trouble. <laughs> Job complete. At least he admitted it, right? That he has a thing for her. <laughs> so, according to these decrypted files, Octavio is pumping tar from underneath the foundations of buildings so he can sink them into the canals on a whim. He's going to demonstrate this destructive ability to the people of Venice during his opera recital on the first day of Carnival. To counter this threat, we'll first destroy the balloons and sign advertising the recital. If no one shows up, he'll have no reason to sink a building. Next, the blueprints to the main tar vacuum have been cleverly split into three parts and hidden in local coffee houses owned by Octavia. Unfortunately, they're under constant guard. So you'll need to use a disguise to get us inside. Also, some big Vincenetti goons have been called in as insurance for the recital. Given their size, I think it's prudent to fool Carmelita's eight mercenaries into taking them out for us. And finally, we'll have to convince Murray into taking to the field. If he's learned the aboriginal ball form, it'll be just the thing for destroying the local tar reservoirs. All right, people, I was going to leave off this first explosive episode. I hope you guys are enjoying. I know I didn't talk very much, but I'm like so absorbed. I'm in awe of this fucking game. Oh, just like so much is getting thrown at me. Ah, oh, it's just, oh, it's so good. The fact that we also got it confirmed that he's got a thing for, her, I mean, that's been kind of obvious the last two games. <laughs> Anyways, I'll stop taking much of your day. Um, the episodes are going to be a little different, kind of the same. Uh, I'm going to be recording a bit longer. So, yeah. Also, expect the, uh, these videos I record in batches. Just to tell you right now, I record them in batches. So, you guys will, you know, get them out on time every day. From uh, Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday is when they're going to be coming out. That's the main series. Wednesdays is Zelda Wednesdays. Weekends are random videos from whenever I want to experiment. But, yeah, guys, all, all I got to add to that is uh, just keep in mind that I'm recording these weeks ahead of time when they come out. And, uh, yeah, I'll catch you guys tomorrow for another random video unless it's you know the second part of this and uh with that bye bye smile have a great time dress warm be cozy have some tea have your soup inside be all toasty warm unless you're somewhere where there's no snow then i'm mad at you i don't like you right now you're not my friend oh, just kidding bye 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 bye